Hi guys, I hope you understood the previous one. This is the fourth sum of exercise 1.5. So it is to expand the following given five numbers. So first one, we have log 1000. Now 1000 can be written as 10 cube. And we know we had few points, so we have few points. So log a power n will be equal to n log a. So therefore this will be equal to 3 log 10. Next, second question. We have log 128 by 625. So now let's uh, prime factor is 128 with 2. So 264, 2 into 32. 2 into 16, 2 into 8, 2 into 4, and 2 into 2. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So this will be, so this you can this can be written as log 2 power 7 by now if we find factor is 625 with 5, uh, 6, 5 into 125 next 5 into 25 next 5 into 5 so this will be 5 power 4 so the second point we also had is log x by y log x by y will be equal to log x minus log y so log 2 power 7 my i mean to say log 2 power 7 by log 5 power 4 will be equal to log 2 power 7 minus log 5 power 4 and what was the first point log a power n so log a power n is ln log a so this will be equal to 7 log 2 minus 4 log 5 next we are done with second one next what is the third one third one we have log x square y cube z power 4 so let's do third one here log x square y cube z power 4 so there is another point formula which is log x into y is equal to log x plus log y so since we have three numbers here it will be log x plus log y plus log z so we can write it as log x square plus log y cube plus log z power 4 and again by the first formula log a power n is n log a this will be equal to 2 log x minus 3 log y plus 4 log z. Next one, fourth one we have log p square q cube r power 4. So we have to do the board mass rule here. First, we should do the division first. So log x by y is equal to log x minus log y so this will be log p square q cube minus log r power 4 next uh, log x into y is log x plus log y so log p square into log i mean to say p square q cube is log p square plus log q cube minus log r power 4 and again by log a power n formula n log a this will be equal to 2 log p plus 3 log q minus 4 log r next fourth one is done last one we have fifth one log x cube i mean to say under root x cube by y square so fifth one we have log under root x cube by y square so we know that root x will be equal to x power 1 by 2 so this we can write as this can be written as log x cube by y square whole power 1 by 2 so by the first one we have log a power n is n log a so this will be 1 by 2 log x cube by y square now we have log x by y which will be equal to log x minus log y so 1 by 2 log x cube minus 
log y square. Now log a power n is n log a. So this will be equal to 1 by 2 into 3 log x minus 2 log y. If we multiply 1 by 2 with both of the 3 log x and 2 log y, we will get 3 by 2 log 2 minus 2 by 2 log y. And 2 by 2 is 1. So this will be equal to 3 by 2 log 2 minus log y. I hope you understood the sum. It was pretty easy. Thank you. Subscribe. Bye-bye.